welcome to the Cooking with Kevin show. Today we're going to do grilled cheese, but we're not going to do it in a skillet or a pan or a griddle. We're going to do it on the home iron. You have different settings on the iron. A lot of people don't know that. You have your rayon, polyester, cotton, uh, linens, and the last setting is grilled foods. Put it on the grilled food setting. Then all you have to do is take your butter. I use French butter. There's nothing better than French butter. Even when you say it, brr. Could you please pass the brr? I think that's how you pronounce it. Anyway, I got that in France when I was doing the comedy cellar over there. Uh, take your butter and put it on your bread. It doesn't take long. This is great for the Super Bowl. Yes, it is. All the guys will be coming over and, you know, you won't look gay if you uh, cook on an iron. Okay. They like that. Hey, that's real cool. Hey, you're not gay because you cook on an iron. So how could you possibly be gay? I'll, I'll put my cheese on the bread. I have both sides buttered. I have plenty of cheese here. I also have some salt, okay? Shirley Temple salt. I'm going to sprinkle my tomatoes with a little bit of salt, okay? Not all of it. It kind of brings out the flavor of the tomato. Uh, put the tomato on. One, two, and three. And then we have bacon. Yes, we do! There's nothing better than bacon. Look at that, huh? That's nice. We're going to put that on. I know, we're almost there. Okay, our sandwich is almost ready. Kind of give it a start, pat it on the grill food setting. All right, as you can see right there, as you can see, I already did a test, test one. I wouldn't add water to the iron, and I wouldn't tell your partner, your wife, anybody that you're using the iron in the kitchen. You know, they'll go out after they iron something and they'll say, uh, people will say to them, my God, you smell fantastic. You smell like grilled cheese. And they go, really? I smell like grilled cheese. And they go, God damn it, anyway, he's using that who iron. Who uses an iron? Really? Tell me. Tell me who is using an iron. Oh, uh, honey, I, uh, I can't make it to the function uh, tonight. I've got just too much ironing to do. God, it's really piled up over the last few days. You know, I just didn't keep up with it. You have to keep up with your ironing. You really do. So I can't make it. I'm sorry. I'm sad, too. It's going to be okay. I'll get it done. You don't hear that conversation anymore, do you? Do you? No, you don't. Oh, my God, look at that. That is beautiful. I just pulled it off. Uh, that is ready. Uh, let's grill it for a little. I like it a little darker. Grilling the bread, melting the cheese, bringing out the flavors in the tomato. What do you say? Tomato or tomato? I don't know. It depends on where I'm at. You know, sometimes I'll say tomato. Other times I'll say tomato. If I'm in Newport, I'll say tomato. You know, if I'm down in the village, I'll say, yeah, let me have a tomato. I want a tomato with that. Ah, uh, yeah, I'll have mine with a tomato. Newport? Yes, I'll have the tomatoes. Thank you. Thank you very much, yes. Oh, yeah, that is a beauty. Look at the, uh, look at where the iron is, has not cooked it right there, and that's a real nice shape. You know, you want that. The fellas like that. So you turn it over and grill the other side. Listen to that. Oh my God, I, I wasn't even thinking. I was doing uh, my crazy, uh, okay, there we are. Oh yeah, oh, that's good. I got, I'm gonna have to use the spatula. No, it came off beautifully. Let's take a look at the iron. Really nowhere, cleans up beautifully. Just take your spatula, get that out of there. I'm gonna cut it diagonally because I think that's nicer. I just think it has a little bit more class when you cut it diagonally. Oh, that grilled beautifully. I'm going to put it on a nice plate here. 
And you see how I do it like that? Isn't that nice? Isn't that beautiful? There's your grilled cheese. It tastes like pants. I like it. It tastes like big pants. Put your big pants on. Damn you anyway, walking around with tight pants. Put them on. Put the big pants on. The Lobermans are coming over.